Happy Monday to you, my dear friends. This is Sister Daisy of the Daughters of St. Paul, sharing with you today's reflection from the Gospel Power. Jesus put before the crowd another parable. The kingdom of heaven is like a mustard seed that someone took and sowed in his field. It is the smallest of all the seeds, but when it has grown, it is the greatest of shrubs and becomes a tree, so that the birds of the air come and make nests in its branches. He told them another parable. The kingdom of heaven is like yeast that a woman took and mixed in with three measures of flour until all of it was leavened. Jesus told the crowds all these things in parables. Without a parable, he told them nothing. This was to fulfill what had been spoken through the prophet. I will open my mouth to speak in parables. I will proclaim what has been hidden from the foundation of the world. Brothers and sisters, God's design for the world is being accomplished surely and uncontrollably like the growth dynamism of the master seed, like the hidden but powerful action of the yeast that causes the dough to expand. Beyond what our senses can perceive, everything is falling into place as God intends it. The heavenly kingdom is being revealed to those whose eyes are empowered to see and whose ears are empowered to hear and whose hearts are empowered to understand. Kingdom knowledge is given from above. Jesus, by speaking in parables, passes on the knowledge to those whom the Father chooses, to the simple and the childlike. God, our Father, we come to you in our need to ask your protection against the COVID-19 that has disturbed and even claimed lives. We pray that you guide the people tasked to find cures for this disease and stem its transmission. Protect the medical experts that they may minister to the sick with competence and compassion. We pray for those afflicted. May they be restored to health soon. Protect those who care for them. Grant eternal rest to those who have died. Give us the grace in this trying time to work for the good of all, to help those in need. We implore you to stop the spread of this virus and to save us from our fears. Grant all these through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. We fly to your protection, O Holy Mother of God, do not despise our petition in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers. O glorious and blessed Virgin, Amen. Our Lady Health of the Sick, pray for us. Saint Raphael the Archangel, pray for us. Saint Rock, pray for us. Saint Lawrence Ruiz, Pray for us, St. Pedro Colomson, pray for us. <laughs> 